Uh, what do you mean, uh? Don't go, Twitch uh. Twitch flashed at me and went back to offline. Oh, good. Well, the, box just say, the bots just said you started up, but my Twitch is saying you're not. One minute. Dashboard, there we go. I was say, dashboard says live. You know, I was well aware it was my my end, given that my Twitch flashed. Doesn't normally do that. Eh. Live unstable. Average stream bitrate too high. The fuck is too high now? What? Admittedly, oh, without this, the game, this is just... stable. Yeah, because, like, the actual, just the main screen you've got now, it seems perfectly fine. No hitching or anything. Bit rate, not frame rate, dear. Yeah, but bit rate can affect my frame rate. Ah, got it. Right, yeah. It doesn't the, affect the, your frame rate, but the, it doesn't affect what you're sending to the server. Like, the Twitch dashboard says... Average stream bitrate too high, unstable. Then it sends you to the inspector, where the inspector says, "Stable." Is it Twitch being a Twitch. Twitch is fucking doing something. Yeah. Anyway, hello. Apparently, the average bitrate is around three thousand five hundred kilobits per second. Four thousand five hundred spikes will cause viewers to buffer and possibly experience issues. Very high bitrate spikes will cause persistent buffering for viewers because they can't catch up. My bitrate currently says 6,000. Do! Look at what my bitrate's actually set to. Uh, 2 live. to 5 to 3,000 is what people usually stream at until you get better encoding options, but that's seven years ago, so that's probably gone up a little bit. The better encoding options come with affiliate and partner. But that's my point. Yeah, mine's at 6,000 CBR. Eh, you should be fine then. Hello. Might just be Twitch having an issue on the back end. Detect it might be part of it is thinking you're just a base user and the other part's going, no, 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 this is fine. Twitch is just being Twitch. Well, if there's any problems, um. Fuck. Basically. Yes, hello. Uh, we're doing more Minecraft today. Uh, between streams, since it has been a hot minute, uh, I've done a little bit. I have moved the fan setup that we had over there that I kept swapping out. And we have an actual fan setup with all of them. Uh, not all of them have filters at the moment. The haunting one doesn't have a filter because we're not really needing to haunt anything at the moment. Um, soon, TM, but not now. Uh, the other thing was in the new base. Quick. The new base now has a second room in it. Just as empty as the first one, but we're gonna hopefully change that today. Uh, what I need to do is I need to get a ton of wood together, some description, and just get a load of chests. Storing all of the stuff, DM. What we'll do for now, I think, is we'll use sophisticated storage. Storage. And, uh... Go from there, I think, you know. Uh, so we just need a ridiculous amount of wood. I don't think it matters what wood, we can just make oak stuff. Plus, you know, we've got the sawmills. So I'm gonna go for the ones over here, because they're huge.
Uh, what I also wanted is uh, I want to be able to get to Terra Steel. I can get the Terra Steel Magnet and um, Hoi. Ring of Mana. Hello. Because I need the bigger radius magnet. It's always magnet with you, isn't it? Magnet this, magnet that. Yeah. I mean, why wouldn't it be? Magnet is good. Less work for me. Just have stuff come to me rather than me have to go to stuff. Max, that's known as delivery. Yeah. Now, what in the <laughs> hell? Hello? Are you in a break? Did it reach the maximum vein mine? No. Maximum vein mine is 64 blocks. Ow. Being yeeted at. Oh yeah, I'm still on the, the peanut butter. left a little speck above again when you cut down that tree. I think that's just the leaves because it's too close to this one. Hello! No, previous one, it was like separated. Oh, I see it, yeah. Very strange. Max out and getting hammered. Only time I do. Go away. That was an interesting set of floating arms. Goes the rain. I see now that one did say sixty four. That one I was expecting. Zombify piglin, apparently. Lightning strike? Almost certainly. You might have enough log for a little bit. And the zombie gone. Hey, you did it. Yes, stupid. That's not the one that gets you a music disc. Unfortunately, but I don't know. About that sort of thing. Alright. Later, maybe? I don't know. Right now? Nah. What is later with us in Minecraft packs? Not right now. Yeah, but half time I don't even feel like we get to later. Exactly. Thank you very much. Hello.
clothes in there. Try to light. Uh, alright. Basically just slam in anything where it'll fit. Like I said, we're gonna... Go... Ah, me back. We're gonna go ahead and uh, start... Well, okay, we're gonna start. We're gonna make an attempt to start moving. Yeah, stuff to the base. Oh, wait, I'll left click, there we go. No, it's been a while, and I can't remember which click I've got to click to get stuff to go. Well, to be fair, I haven't exactly used... Whatever this is from again, Alex is in a while. Those are there, those in there, we do that, done. Oh, those are different sizes. Thank you very much. Not so much for uh, trying to save space, I've just traded one thing for another, apparently. Could you make them into some torches and then put them in the backpack somewhere? Yeah, that's gonna plan, I think. There we go. Alright. So we need uh, software storage stuff. Which needs a bunch of redstone torch. Uh. Oh. I was gonna say, how the hell am I out of redstone? Turns out, I'm kinda not. Oh no, Max, you're running low on redstone. Whatever will you do? I decraft the many, many blocks. Alright, so let's see. Can we do this? Oh. How am I doing it? Alright, so this should be... This. This. Huh. No chest from these? Okay, well, so much for that plan. Weird. Ah. Uh, could be because then. No, I mean, no, because they have to be tagged as. Ah, oh, I don't need chests attacked as plank. Nope, chests are not tagged as plank. Oh no, wait, no, they're the- Oh no, that's aether plank. Okay, so... That was a bust. Alright, uh... But, okay. Uh, what can we use this for? Alright, well, we've now got a supply of wood for making, uh, great cogwheels, I guess. Uh, you just sort of... There. Why not? Uh, okay, so we need some actual wood wood, then. Have a bit of... that work out for you. I bet it didn't go well. It's a rather shocking development. Hmm. Here comes another one. Oh no, he's changed his mind. Uh, no, he's definitely changed his mind on account of being on fire. Attack me anyway. Rude. One last version of violence. I didn't come down low enough. Oh well. I don't know what it is with this biome and all the flies. 
I need to stop because the maggots keep getting into the wood cutting system. It's because they keep running into the saws, isn't it? Yes. Which still stands though, I don't know what it is with this biome and all the flies that keep buzzing. Uh, what biome are you in? Grassland? Grassland. I'm assuming it's um, an Alex's thing. Is it all of the flies from Alex? Oops. Why can I hear another phantom? What? Huh? Okay then. Yeah, Alex's. Uh, apparently they're attracted to dead and dying things. Oh, yeah. Does, does dead inside count? Um, apparently. Okay. Apparently they will attack and murder zombies. And get attacked by spiders. Yeah. I've been seeing that happening a lot. Makes sense. Oh yeah. Not saying it doesn't. Right, so that is... Oak chest, sulfur storage, and then what we want to do. We're not going to be using this. Like, uh, yeah, we want to go the copper route because copper means we use less iron. I actually genuinely like that they've added that. I think that's really cool. Right. So do okay. So what the dev of uh, software storage has done is there's now copper tiers to stuff between base yeah. and iron. So before, we'll, we'll use chests as an example. You had the regular chest, then you surround that with eight iron, you get an iron chest. Well, you can still do that. You can still take the base chest, surround it with eight iron, you'll get an iron chest. Or you can surround it with eight copper, get a copper chest, which is slightly worse, but then you only have to spend four iron to go from copper to iron. Yeah. Okay, so it's it's the same. I forget which one it was that did like the silver as well. That was iron chests. Ah. Okay. Right. Uh, so how big is an iron chest when doubled up? Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve by one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, twelve by nine. That shouldn't be too terrible. I think that should be enough. And then we've got all these chests we can use for, you know. Bits and pieces later. Uh, we'll put those in here for now. Uh, we'll keep these in here for now because obviously we're going to be using those for upgrades later. So that. No. Oh, that's cool. Hmm. So the crows in Alex's mobs. Yes. Can be quite irritating when they're untamed, but you can actually set them up to do um, automation tasks. So if you tame them and then they will gather items around a hay bale and look for a container with a item frame on it, be that a chest or a furnace or something, and try to put it in the side if it matches the item they're holding. Okay then, that's pretty cool. Need four more, so that's half a stack of you to view. Going through the list. Emu. Big flightless birds that roam savannas and badlands. They are super good at dodging ranged attacks. Okay. This is a reference to the uh, war the Australians lost against the Oh. Right. Yeah, of course it is. Literally, you go to the page, and the second sentence, like se a third sentence, it legends say that these creatures once won a great war against the technologically advanced nation, simply due to their uncanny ability to dodge projectiles. Right, let's start emptying this out. We're going to want this to be set up properly, so we want things like ores and bars. Like 
take that with the pickaxe. So we want this. Side. So this this next bit is going to be a lot of back and forward. And not you. You're going to go in the ground. Not you. Not you either. And then what we can do is we can pull the uh, upgrades out of here as well. By this, I may have to do sooner rather than later. You, you, those, that. Okay, I think that's everything. Oh, no, the bad salary. Right, so then we can... At least one star upgrade that requires a multiplier higher than one. Oh. Thanks! Well, not now, G-Force. I'll update you later. Right, so we organize that. There we go. So, you, 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 and you are all going to be in the one next to it, because that's going to be tool stuff. Now, we've got the cooking press that is technically a tool, but that's going to go in with uh, the cooking stuff, rather than rather, uh, tool. It's rather focused on a singular task, isn't it? Yeah. Right, uh, then we've got all the create stuff as well. Um, let's see, we want the actual create stuff. Our stuff. Why do you not stack with this? Are you still... Right, I'll be there back in a minute. I'm getting a drink. No worries. Okay. Uh, yo, 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 yo. Technically, you, you, go again. We'll put crate on this one all the way down here. Create your date. That's pretend, yeah. Create. Yep. No, no. Yes, technically. There we go. Technically, the glass is from create, but we're going to put that in with the rest of the glass because it'll be used for more than it'll be create item. Alright, so that's most of that then. So, tools, tools, tools. These will probably get their own, but these. Our stuff can go just as well for now. And obviously, this is all going to be temporary because once we get to the point that we can do uh, refined storage, uh, we will be doing that. Alright, let's go for mob drops. Uh, I'm probably going to want to 
recolor that or color that or what. Bone blocks only technically, but whatever. Uh, blink sacks, eggs. Let's moat. Goes in. Uh, yeah. Good. Okay. And this one. Carpet, technically, because it's made of wool. I guess. Makes sense in my head, at least. Uh, string, rotten flesh, gunpowder, enderpearls, cobwebs, mac and cream. Tools as well. Blocks of slime, slime balls, bones, those things, phantom membranes, more maggots, goddamn. And spider eyes. Way more tools in here as well, good god. I mean, to be fair, this wasn't the uh, most organised of bases, so... Well, once the serpent jumped out of the sea, it was very rapidly a temporary base. Exactly! Like, oh yeah, this is fine, this is fine. That's a big serpent. It's now no longer fine. <clears throat> right, uh, so let's do... Start doing blocks then, like dirt, soft stuff, stones, uh, so yeah, glass, stones, a frickin' tool. Oh, and I keep thinking that's a plank. Flint, yeah, that's gonna go in there as well, miss some rotten flesh as well, god damn. Sky stone, sandstone, bricks, smooth basalt. In here, smooth basalt in here. Yeah. Uh, wood we're leaving till later. Okay, next. Nope, next. Yep, moon sand, stone stairs. Dirt. Stone brick stairs, ash from ice fire, nether brick. Bricks, cobblestone, stairs, stairs. Stone, slabs. Okay. Softer stuff. Ish. Bounce. Oh, 
don't think it's liking me going backwards. I can't imagine why. Moss is technically a soft thing, but we're going to put it in with stone because you need stone to get more of it. Oh. Eh. Mm -hmm. glass out of what was the gate chest. Uh, that, those are all staying there for now because there's my backup thing. There's a guy. Fault. Far out of there. Let's put thanks no. Before here, God knows what. Probably because of the aforementioned stupid. Well, that's terrifying. Just looking through continuous. So one of the Alex mobs, if you find the uh, Deep Dark, is a mobile version of the... Um, what is the uh, not the sensor, the other one. The Shrieker. Yeah. Sure is. That's terrifying. It's a pain in the ass. That's just going to have to stay up. That's it, that just that just barrel, that one, that's full. Let's grab what we can and we're out of here.
Definitely gonna cut down on the amount of times I have to come back and forwards because I think the game is already starting to suffer. Yeah. 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 Right, so we've got uh stones, soft stuff, so we need wood, nature, food uh food probably do. That way then. Uh, there. Nature of food. Red kelp. Crap. And inedible stuff. Seeds. technically all right we'll start from the smallest one and go along I guess so let you have five spawners at once nice nature there Come on, behave yourself. Definitely don't think the guy, the game like going backwards and forth that many times. Good food, food. Stuff. are technically food. Get a barrel. Come on, spare barrel. Nine barrel. Let's Drop stuff. Oh, I can just do that. Good, right. Drops, that's technically good. This thingy. That's this thingy. We, we have the Villagers Plus, which adds extra. Um, Job site blocks. Right, okay. Speaking of which, we're gonna get villagers over here somehow. Oh, I remember what we were doing with that. We were trying to get freaking uh, things together, weren't we? The um... mob imprisonment tools? That's the one! We we're getting gas tears. Um, that wasn't quite going as I wanted it. Right, kelp blocks. I'm gonna put in nature. I'll put kelp itself in food. Thing is that kelp itself is food, so um, I mean it's not going to cause you any trouble by building a base in the mining dimension. What isn't? I'm just checking. Is there anything that you need biome-specific stuff for? Not that I thought of. No. Okay. 
I did have this thought, and I couldn't think of anything. You know what I'm like, I'll forget. I'll just... Alright, uh, wheat and hay bales, I'm going to technically put food, because that's what they mean. Boss, that's you. Uh, seeds for not food stuff go in nature. Drop, I'll drop, I'll drop. That's not technically a mob drop, but that's where they live. And like I said, this all becomes mildly pointless once we get to refined storage, but for now, it's uh, gonna be. As it is, ah, uh, no. I'll pick it up, there you go. Definitely gonna have to get some more upgrades at some point soon. What going where, I don't know. Again, like I said, eventually it's gonna be uh, fine storage, but far away that's going to be. Hopefully not very far away, but we don't exactly flush for power right now. Hey, you don't have many generation ways I can think off the top of my head. Actually, ha like actually, ha no, we've got power. Oh, you have the old power as well. Okay. That's. Softening. Uh, advanced alloy, that's in there. Ash, these are mob. Uh, mm, yeah, but where? Hmm. No, these are mob drops, they can go in here for now. Yeah, mint's raft. Saddle I'll put into tools. Normally I put that in mob drops, but they're probably gonna get their own barrel or chest or something. If you're playing this pack but the RPG version, if you have create, create can move normal spawners. Yeah, if you make spawners as part of a contraption, they'll move. So like the... I think the piston can. I definitely know the rope pulley can move them. So like I've used the rope pulley to move both spawners and uh, budding amethyst blocks before, both of which are not supposed to be movable in vanilla Minecraft.
hello do It's everything except that chest and that chest. That chest is staying here because obviously I don't think we can sleep in the mining dimension, so we're going to still have to spawn here. Hey, do. Got all the building-y bits to come with me as well. I think once we've moved everything over, I'm going to have to reboot the game. It's not like in the fact that I've had to go back and forth and back and forth and back and forth over and over again, huh? Has, it has very much not enjoyed that fact. Uh, Max is moving to the mining dimension because he's currently by the sea, and the Fire and Ice mod adds sea serpents. And within about the first, I want to say the first six hours of you playing, one yeah, of them jumped. Yeah. yeah, one of them jumped out of the sea and basically wrecked half the place around him by knocking down trees and stuff like this. So Max has been looking to move for a while, but every direction he goes in, he finds danger. I think my, the favourite one we had was when you went up. Was it the west and found the ice dragon? Yeah, west found an ice dragon, north we found a fire dragon. E no wait, east east was the iron east was the ice dragon, north was the fire dragon, west is just way more ocean, and south is just more ocean as well. So like, basically Max you know went, I can't go anywhere in the open world, we'll go elsewhere. Yeah. Cause why the hell not? He has the technology. Wait, I'll be back in a minute. Oh dokey. Unfortunately not. We do have carry-ons so we can pick things up and move, but because I have to right-click on the mining dimension portal block to get here, it would just place the thing down rather than uh, let me go through. Uh, not you. Not those. Come on. There you go. Yeah, I'm zombie. Tanya stuff. I'm gonna go in this one, even though there's a lot of Tanya stuff right now, but yeah. All good, all good, all good, all good, all good, all good. Right. Get rid of those. Here you go, get out of here. Right then, these backpacks go on the wall. Hmm. 
Yeah, I'm not exactly the most knowledgeable at Create either. I have to learn everything from YouTube or Meep. Mostly Meep, think about it. Ugh. Fine, just hold a bit longer. Come on, we've only got to go back and forth like maybe twice more. Uh, it's not gonna hold. Okay, quick reboot of the game then. <sighs> but, oh boy, going backwards and forwards between the mining dimension about twenty times. Uh, do. Not, um, did not make the game like me very much. To sector actually close the thing. Launcher, and then we reopen the thing. And play. What happened? Just rebooting the game. Is it because you were yeah. going between dimensions? So Dimension much? hopping kind of took a it took a bit of a toll on it. Yeah. I too have a toll taken out of me when hopping dimensions. behave now? Probably not, but... To be fair, I mean, it didn't exactly do it quickly. It did take a few times before it started hitching and then just, you know. So long as it doesn't do what the previous pack did. Well, no, it's more the fact that, you know, old computer and old packs are just like, ah, you have changed dimension once. I'm going to lag for six weeks now. Fuck you. Yeah, but that, that's my point, is the previous pack started hitching and then didn't stop. Hmm. Right. Uh, how do I want... I'm concerned if I break this, it's not going to keep its content. First watch. Come here real quick. 
Sophisticated storage. It moved I mean, me. I can break it and it not technically be a problem because uh, cobble will go into this thing. But that means we're going to lose 13,000 cobble. Okay. Ah. Can't break the limited gold barrels that would cause too many item entities to drop. Consider using packing tape or break it while sneaking to skip this check. Okay. And now you've turned it into one of these weird fucking things. Alright, so what's packing tape? No, slime ball on a piece of paper. Have this. Makes sense. I get eight uses here to... Slime ball. Map. Boop. Ta da. Okay. Uh, so now I need buckets. Bucket singular, apparently. About taking the water with me. Did you manage that? That is impressive. Right. Uh, where do we want to put things? Now is the issue. I mean, the kilns I can probably keep in this room.
Is it those filters you can hold shift over to show what's in them, or is that not this one? Uh, we'll have to check. Nope. Oh, it just it just says allow list. Just like says it on. Oh, well, at least you have that. Three. Yeah, that's right. Because the top ones didn't need any filters. This is the wrong bag. These will just go into go that, 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 and that. I'm gonna have to move to any system. Well, oh, that's gonna that's gonna be fun. I think. Would the farm be... will leave here for now. For the Britannia stuff. Yes. Could you make the um, mana pool into a minecart contraption and move it that way without losing what's in it, or are you happy? Just oh, I'm to I'm just gonna put it in my ring. Oh yeah, that's a good point. Uh, I am almost certainly gonna have to make a new. Gonna need several next. Well, no, I meant sooner rather than later, kind of thing. All right, let's start by putting the boiler back together. So... Where the hell did you... and chef it there it is go probably not that way this time and we're gonna want Water there in a minute. Back again. All I have to do is uh, power to that. I'll probably put a water or something. I have the little one. I don't.
hogs. Yep. Look at you getting used to using uh, sideways water wheels. It's still kind of weird, but eh. It's because it abuses the uh, flowing water physics. Well, no, it's how they work now. Like, because before you had to go all the way around them to get the most out of it, now you don't. No, you could, you could still do flowing water around the sides of water wheels. Just meant that you couldn't use the bubble stream to get the most power out of it. No, it doesn't. Yeah. I need some more. <laughs> uh, excuse me. Ah, yeah. Uh, crafting table. Oh yes, do I want a bucket or do I want a bucket? Hmm. Obviously you want a bucket. No, not that bucket. Not that one. Bucket, bucket, a bucket. God. Feels like the start of a two Ronnie sketch. Four candles. I have a t-shirt for that, don't make me. <laughs> and also forks. Bathroom plug. Alright. So we'll fill the little one by three first. That way that grab as much. This. Yeah. 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 And yeah. And that's not what I want. So your problem is is that the water is flowing into each other and going down to the lowest level. What you needed to do is place them all down and place dirt all but the last ring and then let it all flow through. There we go. Oh, I know why. Hold on. That's right. What's the input rate? Four millibuckets per tick. Yeah, it ain't going fast. I have enough steam for the level one. Uh, enough water for the level. Yeah, this is why I normally 
do that set up to power one by campfires and then use the 2048 SU from that tiny boiler to then do a water pump for the actual boiler. Um, screw this. No, the water wheel stay because they're providing water to the first boiler. But I think your current issue is that the way the water's been done, it's only powering the top water wheel, not powering any of the rest of them. Oh, God damn it! How did you say to do this again? Fill everything except the top one and then... And slowly mine down, yeah, by wandering out at a time so that the water keeps flowing round and down. Alright, there's one. Nope, second one is still not writing. You might have to fill them in as you go as well, start from the bottom and work your way up. That sucks. I mean, for what? So, if you take out all the water you've got now. No, oh, no, it wouldn't work that way, would it? I don't know then. With difficulty, it looks like. Yeah. things upon yourself. So does the bulb stream help anymore? Nope. Not how they work anymore. You only have to use one piece of water. You only ever had to use one piece of water anyway. No, no. One piece of water at all. So what you can do is... Um, we say that's the water wheel. What you can do is you can have... Literally just water pouring past this line here, and it will work at full, oh, okay. at full, uh, at full speed. That's the one. Six, 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 six right. So what you're saying is I can run... You want me to run a little boiler to power the water 
for the big boiler. Yeah. It, it is kind of like um, daisy chaining boilers, but if I, I found it was the easiest way to get the rotational force you need to get enough water into a max size boiler. Uh, engine uh, pump rubber chain drive gear shifts gear boxes speed up stress on it but, uh, um cog wheels that gear box thing, don't we? Where is he? Yeah, he oh, it's encased chain cogwheel, that was it. Yeah, but isn't that your basic one? No, that's going to be that. Now we're at three. Not perfect, but.
Oops. A little bit too quick. Oh, that's good. You in here? Out of the way. Wait, no, need those ones. Come back. amount of tanks is four for a boiler yeah so how you arrange them thought it did nope it says in the pond uh, minimum minimum size is four tanks hmm. I do this boiler it's a tall boy no, I'm serious, that's what they were called. They were called tall boys. Put the stuff back to the... thousand <laughs> so then we use that power another pump to get the fur yeah. big one and if you have access to them I would always recommend using a um, speed controller to make sure you can control it finally to get the most water you can but obviously that depends on if you have them or not 
Uh, decision mechanism. Could potentially make one quite slowly. What, is that a gold plate? Gold. Yeah. Cogwheel, big cogwheel, iron. The brass casing afterwards. Brass, go brass. Yeah. yeah. Okay. I need to take the gold plate off and put it back on again. Hmm. A sec. Uh, what do I need? Five times? Small, big. Oh, small. Stopped. Why is this stopped? Why has it stopped? Ah, uh, I see. Small, big, nugget. 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 Mechanism. Gold plate. <laughs> Fuck you! <laughs> and then uh, strip log still have some you plus one of you equal one of you right quest complete rotational speed controller break you break you so you need a big wheel there. Go there. Wait, not for that one, is it? Is it for that one you wanted it on? Yeah. Because now one... you can use that rotational speed controller to speed up the pump for the main um, okay. boiler. Not that bag, come on. You need the gearbox. Make it vertical. I can do the pump. Oh, I thought you were going to use another couple of the chain drive things. Yeah, could do. Got more than enough chain drive. Given what you found in the nether, yes, yes, you do. I should have done 37 of the damn thing. Right, let's put the depot under.
disconnect that real quick. Right. Like These. If I could push this. Okay. Yep, oh, max speed. There you go. What? Oh, right. Uh. Yep. One, two, three, four. By, what, level 9 water at that? Mm hmm. Level 4 on size, but size is equal to fix. Heat's going to be the problem, and I use quotes for problem because it's not really a problem, but it is the current problem. Yeah, the current limitation. Yes. Uh, the major thing is how much SU is that water pump taking? Ten twenty four at current speed. And you've got twenty forty eight from the one yep. steam engine, so you could have two of those and double your water. Yep. So then you could power that boiler with nine um blaze burners with superheated fuel. Yep. No and have a ridiculous boiler. Yeah. A boiler to match to rival the stars. Yeah, that's why I say do that daisy chain thing because you can see how it's that will now run that water forever. Mm. Okay. Now we gotta get things on this. Uh, shafts, where are they? That's the way. Yes. Now, how the hell have you managed that? Right, so we've now got what? 20? We've got 2048. Which is stupid, but whatever. So it's 2048 because it's defined, defined by your lowest stat. Yeah, which is a heat at the moment. Uh, we're going to have to work out a dueling system, which means we're almost certainly going to need an arm. Yeah, you don't get the straws in this one, do you? No, we have the straws, I just don't have anything to put in it yet. All right, okay. I thought latex worked. As a fuel? Do you not have a fuel cost? Can you not burn it? Nope. Yeah, never mind then. I'm saying that does that actually show up in here? Oh yeah, liquid burning. So liquid burning, we have heavy oil, biofuel from either or, refined fuel from thermal, ethanol from immersive, lava, light oil from thermal, creosote, crude oil, immersive biodiesel, plant oil, seed oil, or tree oil. That may have oh, been what you were thinking of. I might have been thinking of tree oil, yes. That does make it standard heated for four minutes for a bucket, though. I mean, that the is going to need a lot. The big one is if you can get it running. Yeah, superheat for 20 minutes. And it's not exactly expensive to produce the stuff. But what's just create, takes a lot of create biofuel? Create biofuel... Sugar, cinder flour, and biomass. And biomass is any... Plant or sapling, and plant oil or seed oil. Damn it. 
sticks or flowers or honeycomb or leaves, crops or plant foods. All 100 millibuckets of plant or the only uh, changes in the amount of stuff that goes into it on the solid side. And the fact that it needs to be a heated blaze burner. No, that makes it. He oh no, I see. Yeah, 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 yeah. No man, um, yeah. The liquid that makes it a heated, but yeah. Got it. I got it. Um, brain is not doing the brain today. Uh, so I'm gonna need the major problem there. That would be cinder flour because I'm not entirely certain there is an infinite source of um netherrack. Admittedly, it's not exactly difficult stuff to get, but it's a bit difficult to set and forget. Was that four? That was four... five. So, cobblestone, cinder flower, and 25 millibuckets of lava will get you a netherrack. A netherrack does have a chance to give you two cinder flower in a rushing wheel. So, you can technically do it. Double netherrack, yeah. But that needs lava. Yeah, but that's dripstone. That's true. We've got to find dripstone first. I haven't got any. Nature's compass? Yeah. Because I get the feeling an infinite amount of lava would be helpful. Oh yeah, definitely. Only ways of making lava. Ah, magma crucible. Oh. Yeah. So there's normally a way of making it with create as well, but it's fairly expensive. Uh, superheating cobblestone. That gets you 50. Oof. For that, you could put it in a magma crucible and get a bucket. Granted, that's going to cost 60,000 RF, but, you know. 40,000 if we gave it a magma block. But then, of course, we've also got um, biofuel from Immersive, which is way easier, but it's a lot more work to get more of it. Well, yeah, that's the thing is it take that takes a lot of um, infrastructure, but once you have the infrastructure, it's stupidly cheap. Yeah. Like, why we this, used it this one because requires... we already had farms. Well, this one requires a lot of singular stuff. Like, you know, you need netherrack to make the cinder flower, you need sugar, you need some form of plant thing to make the oil. Whereas the other one requires a lot of multiple things, because you need nine things to get, the to get as much as possible. Plus power. But that's almost certainly going to be the best way of getting some form of superheated fuel. Yes. I mean, what, what were the other uh, superheaters? Uh, we've got biofuel from either Create or Industrial Foregoing, refined fuel from Thermal, or biodiesel from Immersive. Fine fuel, if I remember right, this whole yeah, fractionating still between oils. Which again is doable. It's very doable, but that requires oil. Either there's oil no from Ad Astro or getting... crude oil from thermal. Yeah, there's no easy way of getting an infinite amount of that. Hmm. 
unless you've got the 10,000 bucket thing, but then you may as well just... Yeah. Go for biofuel at that point. Yeah. It'd be a lot easier to get 10,000 buckets of that stuff. Yeah. I should probably test whether that's true or not. Just real quick. Yep. So, what? Guess we don't have a whole lot of power right now, so we're gonna need an arm. Mechanical. Yeah, that's another mechanism. So I need to go grab some. Uh, shafts. I only have 55 on. Sounds like a lot, but. So you tend to vanish quite quickly. Thanks. Where did. Oh, that's. I know I had a bunch of planks. Where did they all go? In the backpack. Backpack was. I get the feeling that you're just gonna break in so I can throw this down. Oh, no. 1024, max speed. Alright then. Alright, so we'll build you. Yeah, so we don't end up with any funny business. that there temporarily so now I need the deployer back wherever the hell I put that out oh, there it is as well. Press gonna run off this. I if it did because it's fairly slow. It does. Nice. Uh, where's my stress armor? Oh, yeah. Okay. I knew it was gonna be close. Once again, Max is perfectly stressed. Perfectly stressed. That's all things should be waiting now. Alright, I need gold. See if we can make a few of these. Uh, should we try for four? Means I'm gonna... Fucking thalassium. Why is thalassium the default? Uh, the pipe can go away, the shafts we need, chain drive casing can go away, wood can go away, those we need, uh, that we don't. Ah, right, because it came out of the wash. I remember. Alright, so, wait, wait a minute, I'm just... Put the planks away. My gears. Yep. 
So, Gold Gear, Big Gear, Gold Gear. Yeah. No, you're not gonna you're not gonna do the other ones. Okay. Yeah, this is where things get confusing with create because the depots get a bit funky with the things that have multiple MBTs. I went to stop because I may I got just enough uh, iron nuggets. Iron nuggets, yeah. Ah, no. All right then. And that I didn't get enough nuts. Five of them. I told you it gets a bit funky. Twenty. It should have been enough. Five times five. But I think it... five times five. No wait, no, it's five times four. I only did four. Yeah, five, five times four. four, yeah. You are right, I think it just ate some. Three. That's four. Nice. Right, so for an arm, we need brass sheet, alloy, and brass casing. do is get a crafting upgrade for my main backpack. There's my mechanical arm. We'll create stuff into here for a sec. I don't know what's going where. Right. But I can technically power that off this once I remove the saw blade. You said this has to come off a depot? So they can only pick up off a depot. That'll go there. I know you don't have any. Fine, I'm trying to plan this shit out in my head. Uh, then we'll have to get something to make fuel. I don't know what. Tried kelp blocks. Kelp blocks would help, yeah.
make a kelp farm, but... I don't know where. Or how, actually. Um, was it harvesters? Okay. Hmm? Harvesters work for that? Or yep. is it... We're just good. All you've got to make sure is that when the harvesters are going round to pick stuff up, they're not on the bottom level because they will take kelp off of blocks and not leave anything to grow. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's like sugarcane and yeah. uh, bamboo. And making sure that when it stops to offload, it's not going to be blocking kelp, that it may suddenly go, oh, yes, I'm just going to drop kelp on the floor now and cause more entities. Hmm. How do we want to go about doing this? We're going to need the catalyst thing. That's a smoking one, so that means we're going to need... That one. Netherrack, that's easy. Okay. Alright, let's get this set. I have to... Work. Nine. Ta da! Also, once we get the fluid going, this will become pointless, but you know. Yeah, but you've got to get there first. Mm hmm. off this kind of don't do I because if I power that off this that's going to take the power from the second pump that I want to use to fill this up so this one I mm, guess true. yeah could do as long as it has enough power Does it, it, like that thing do. doesn't need to be fast exactly that's only running at 256 out of the 2000 odd it said that it was uh, 2000 Oh, 1024. There you go, you have loads. Uh, so I need... Right, I'm oh. going to be back a little bit. Oh, it's in a little bit medicine guess. time. Yeah, no worries. If I just grab... One of these, one of these. And... Yes. Uh, actually, we'll go up again. So I can fit under the belt. I don't have belt that much. Sure was. Okay. Yeah, water physics sometimes are a bit of a pain in the ass. Hey, no targets. Uh, bullshit. Just assigned you targets. What are you talking about? Hmm. That's it. on that that's gonna go Oop. now all of a sudden we've got uh, 16,000 that's very long but I 
kept it like stupid about it. I mean I say let's be stupid about it. It's not stupid. Mass, but we'll fix it in a bit. I'll probably turn it into glass or something. Yeah, there we go. Haven't exchanging gadget yet. You. In which case, then. I didn't put the water in there first, did I? Because I was expecting to get poured out first, and that's. Crouch key bind again. Did we have a crouch key bind? No, oh, no crouching. Uh, here we go. I love where the water's going to be, so this definitely. Uh. 
Now that should be good. Yep, that's water max sound. <laughs> do is heat and size. With the size we've got we can get to level 4, that's fine. Amazing. So, now. That's fine. Work that out. Oh yeah, that's what I need. I need to get another just... press. Let's get all the stuff. Alasium, come. One of those. Nice. But the rest of the blank ones can go like that. Also means I'm going to the fan, but we'll do that in a bit. I'm wanting one of mine right now. Okay, so we're going to need. This there, perfect. What I can do it. Open the wrong backpack. Uh, what I can do is well, get all the chain drives. Run those along, assuming that this. Correction. And a second. Yep, backwards. Oh, I do. Go ahead. Really means I'm gonna more, but whatever. Um, so we need catalysts. I've got to go on these one. No space. Then the depth. Oh, 
of uh, smoking, haunting, washing. Washing one. Lasting one to the gold one. Yes. Yeah. Those are the ones. Just standard one. One, two, four, and now we need to sort out filters. That's the wash on this one, yeah. Right kelp is the smoking one, which the Hey that's this one. You yeah, you're the last thing. How many recipe in it yet? Filter or whatever. This one will use for the kelp. Again, means we're gonna need another. We're in a cased fan, but we can get that fairly easily. <laughs> uh, how's this doing? 120, so I should be able to put the mechanical press back in to make some more. And this will address them. Yeah. Uh, oh, that means I need some depots. You. And you. Start with two and go. Yes, right. You go there. Good. Um, we've got these regular barrels. We copper. Let me stack. You can look on that. Yeah. Uh, oh, I already did. Never mind. Right. Well, that's getting pressed. All right, I'm gonna go take a quick break because I need the bathroom. I'll be back in a few minutes.
have returned. All right. Thank you. Do make some more tanks. So we're at size four. That's now six. Yeah, that's six. Okay. Still at level one because of heat, but we can't do anything about that just yet. I mean, I can if I just give it some. There we go. Level 7 heat, uh, 6 heat rather, bleh. Well, technically no, level 6 boiler. The heat is going up immensely, holy shit. With all of them going, we actually need more steam engines. Because we can only get 16,000 out of each one. Um, what do we need? Uh, gold sheet and sile. Sile. Hmm. Okay. Uh, while we're at it, let's drop a stresso on this. Yo. Uh, so let's do should we do six? can do. attach these here and attach them with the uh, drives. Have you done? Work out how best to connect these all together, dear. Nothing. Uh, the easiest way would be on the side that has the um, stressometer currently. Yeah. Put some shaft in and then just put a, a belt in between them. So now you can pick any point of those to connect off, and they're all connected together. Yeah. I could put these chain drives back in. Mm-hmm. 
That'll work. Yep. Okay. Yeah, it turns out we needed more engines once all nine of them were run. Mm hmm. But water's maxed out, size is now level six, heat is now the issue. Yeah, so you need a steam engine per level of the boiler yes. for max output. That's why we needed more, because we only had three. But that's just the easy way to do, like, to work out how many you need. Mm -hmm. Hey, you do. does work, so that's good. Uh, thing is, we now need fuel before I can go any further. So what do I want to do in the... What would be the easiest fuel for you to get? I'd say charcoal, but you'd need to clear a space to make a tree farm. Yeah. Because what I can do is, um, I need any kelp, I need to press any way to harvest the kelp, I mean that's going to be the, like the harvest in the kelp isn't the, like getting to that. I mean, I could just do charcoal, but again, three fun. I mean, technically, for now, I could do like set the planks that I've got from those blackwood trees. Still got a ton of blackwood logs. Can I run those through? Can't run those through the saw blade. That sucks. That actually doesn't suck. Yeah, but you could um, blast those to charcoal. Yeah, because that'd get more. Um, that'd be what one to eight versus what you get six planks. So no, because that'd be nine items. Yeah, but no. you can't get six plants. You can only get four. That was my point, is if you could get the six plants, sure, go for it. That makes sense. But you can't. Yeah. Charcoal's going to be the right. best way of getting charcoal, then, is going to be... I'm going to need to get one of those catalysts. I thought you'd already set them all up. Yeah, specifically for this. Oh, I see you. Also means I'm going to need some fans, which means I need more alloy. The recipe for that. Uh, add the mixer though. Break that. Get the cog wheel. Should be able to take that around. Yep. Thought that would not 
Jason. You like that, and then I need zinc nuggets and some Anderson. that you can do to make infinite andesite and there might be a method right why do I want infinite andesite right now I'm just thinking like you know, to set up like an infinite supply of the alloy because you can get an infinite supply of iron nuggets yeah and I was just looking through the recipes and andesite with an alchemical catalyst becomes diorite yeah but I think diorite and a cobblestone becomes two andesite. So with the injection of cobblestone, you could just keep making andesite. Mm, no. Uh. Not spinning fast enough? Well, that's one way to speed it up. Yeah, what I should do is get a speed controller, I think. Yeah, normally helps. things Thanks. And Dread Cap lasts a while, Christ. I know it's 20 items worth, but... Crap. Right, so break these and put the speed controller in. There. 
the cogger. Got to get the signal from the, uh, the signal. Uh, power from there to there. Seems easy enough. Yes, sir. Put in some change gear boxes at the same way you've got it currently, and then put a vertical gearbox on the power speed controller. A chain gearbox. No, I don't think so. Chain gear shift, chain drive, chain cogwheel. So yeah, it is literally just going to be a... Uh... Oops. The goddamn gearboxes. It. Did you overtax it? You did. Because you ran out of fuel, so everything slowed down again. Yeah. Uh, yeah, okay. Went the wrong way. Hang on. I put. Yeah, we've got 512 left at current, so... Obviously we need... Else. That's a bit quicker. That would make it even quicker though. Mixer go brr! having fun with the boiler now. I'm going to be having more fun once it's all set back up again.
So we need press the mixer to source. I don't know if I want to do the cobble gem. At least right now. Yeah, it probably is a bit early for that, isn't it? I mean, to be fair, we're, we're going to end up doing the monstrosity, aren't we? Yes. I need the crushing wheels as well. Hmm. Boxes. Rest of them. No. One there, one there. And it should just be a case of crushing meals. And we've overstressed it, damn it. Also going the wrong way, so watch it. Uh, no. Investigate ship. That's what I want. So let's turn this down to sixty-four. I'll get it going again, at least. Yep, those are in the right direction. meals. Now we need saws next, I guess I could do. Uh. 
Und so weiter denn. One of the Stars viewers went on my throne and uh, bought me one of the things that was on there, which is a kilogram bag of chocolate covered peanuts. That may have been a mistake. How many have you eaten so far? Uh, that may have been a mistake. Looking at maybe about half the bag. Maybe. A bit less. Well, there's more than. a bit more than half the bag left. So less than half. But it is very nice chocolate though. So I'm very happy. I don't want to do this. Like more, um, more shafts in this direction, and then what? Chain drive it, gearbox it, and then chain drive it so the saws are on the floor. I mean, I'm gonna have to gearbox it anyway to get the power out from off the wall. Start going that way. So I have to. Why is it you never put these things the way I want them to? Never. That would make sense. All right now that's going to be changed, right? Now I gotta find out which way this goes, so let's grab one. That's going le in the what? Okay. Cool. If that's going that way, uh we need uh plan wait. Planks or shaft, so that's the second one. And that one's strip log, so that one goes there. So then the hopper goes there. Some form of storage goes on top. We'll use the chest. Oop there. That means I'm gonna use a barrel. through the wood crap that got made. You and you. I don't need either. Or the gold ore. Actually, the gold ore. Crushed. Yeah, well, that goes. Also do... That. I'll do all those. Okay. Crushed, and then that. This one on the left. Ta da! What I should do with this is make another one of those compacting upgrades and have it compact the nuggets of experience. Granted, it's gonna turn them into blocks, which means I'll have to decraft them before I want to use them, but more space, so. I am almost certainly going to need.
now what? Um, oh, the, the press and the... Other one. Mixer. I mean, I could technically just leave the mixer where it was over here, couldn't I? Excuse me. It's not ideal, but it's not exact. Oh, crap. 32. Yeah, everything. Alright. Um. And the other thing is the press, then, isn't it? That is a straight through, so I could replace one of the shafts over there with it to be honest. Oh, the millstone as well. Hmm. Not about that. Okay, we're not going to be able to put all this in before some form of thing. over there. Depo that. Okay. So that's the press as well. So with the exception of the millstone, which, I mean, we can technically use the grindstone for most of the millstone recipes, so I'm not too worried about it. Employer was for the plastic stuff. That over as well, aren't we? Yeah. So aside from the cobble gen, which we're not putting in, and the millstone, everything's in. Oh, and the deployer, like I just said. But. It says drop things off and we'll have to go back to the overworld and get the plastic thing. Uh, actually thinking about it, the plastic thing's gonna have to get put away for a while. Just I'm not gonna be able to power it with what I've got. Unfortunately, what I've got is a solar panel. Maybe some problems in trying to do that here. So I don't lose this, this up here. Yeah, I absolutely lose it. Back to the other wall. Hello. Good. Good. We're good. Okay. All right. So I'm assuming you've now worked through everything that you had. No, no, you've still actually got a fair bit of that left. Uh, hold on then. Let's. Golem, I've got a hammer. How do you think that's gonna go? Okay. Uh, I am working on moving the base to its new location in the mining dimension. So tearing things down here, putting them back up again in the other place, and causing problems all the while, as we usually do. Going 
How the hell did that get in there? Alright, so basically just gonna drain all the fluid out of this. Oh, I hear friends. Hi, friends! use 100 of that and 500 water on. I don't mind if there's water left in it because I mean water and I know I'm going to lose a little bit of the rubber, because, you know, we're at 07. But, like, 7 millibuckets, that's what? 6 seconds, maybe? Oh no, how terrible! can use that generator to uh, power the thing, but I'd rather not. We're trying to get fuel for the freaking... Hello. Uh, we're trying to get fuel for the freaking wheelers first. Wow. Ow. Where did he... Assistant today, aren't we? Yeah, right, buddy, what you got? Want pathfinder quill, dye, flowers, snow blossom saplings, stranger hellbark sapling. Okay. Bungee jumping llamas! Bye. Stuff. Let's get this sorted one thing at a time rather than everything at a time. Plus, I'm absolutely gonna have to do another brute and full brute. You know, to the surprise of nobody. Stay out because I'm going to need to charge my battery. That can go in here. Plastic, rubber, whatever. Craft oh, up. Okay, wow, well, we actually had enough for an exact amount. Good. And this is blasting. I really need to mark these. Oh, that's one. Where's the washing? 
you need to go to up to 16. This with you. Uh, output right. Good. Uh, you, you there. He's into here. Empty. Uh, oh, we're gonna have to grab the enchanting table as well. I can probably put that up that corner. It's still only the super basic setup for now, so it doesn't matter too much. Oh, yeah, we do have silk touch. I'm gonna say which of these things has silk touch and can I use it? Turns out the axe does, so yes. Marvelous. Uh, I'm also gonna have to bring the arm over. God knows how the hell. But again, probably another massive one. on the right, grindstone on the left, and that should be level 30. There is power three on breaking three. Hmm. Be better. Breaking three in flame. Uh, that's... We'll live. Um. Eh, you in there. Chests in that one, bone meal in that one. There, right, that's the enchanting table. Uh, I guess the next room is either going to be that direction or that direction. I'm going to do them eventually, both probably. Uh, so, we've got to get. Extractinator, we want his workbench. Crafting table and cutting board, we want furnaces, the nullifier, this, we want this, we want this, this, get on with it! There you go. As well. Backup gear. Tractinator. There. Tinker's workbench can go there, because actually, that. How about that? Trophy. I actually. Uh, Smithing table can go here. Research table. Backpack. Right. Uh, I'm gonna take this chest. This chest can go here. This can have my eyes in it. Like so. if you want. That we don't smoke. Crafting table I'm gonna use to make a crafting table upgrade. 
Nullifier can go right up there. Cutting board, cutting board. Uh, Is that it? it? Right. Before we break down the Britannia setup, I want the one that does the dirt. I can't remember the name of. Rod of the Lands. There we go. Just, you know, infinite dirt sounds like a good idea. So, need a block of coal. That over there. Uh, stone. Uh, any mushroom. What have we got the most of? We only have red ones, so that answers that question. Uh, mana powder, mana steel, powder, powder sugar. Mana steel is a piece of iron, and then what do we need? A piece of dirt and living wood. So let's grab some logs. In case black wood. A living rock. Big and I need my wand of the forest. You're good, you're good. Ta -da! Dirt. Part of the land. There we go. Stack of black wood. Say hello to my friend. Say goodbye to my friends. We will uh, go back through. Actually, we should. Okay. So now I can just do it wherever I want. If I remember rightly, that also works with the building gadget. Let's get a crafting upgrade for my backpack. Enough. Uh,
Boom, crafting table, wherever. Okay. So let's get the flux. Where do we want to go? We'd do that way, couldn't we? Right, what have we got? Uh, through the wall. I think it was five and then the next wall. Two, three, four, five and then the next wall. One, two, three, five. Wall. That. Dust. I think it was 25. Nice. 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 4, 25, yeah. So. 1. Fives, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 17, 18, 19, 21, 2, 3, 4, 5. Then 12, so 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 12. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Get out of here. Right. Numbers. 
One, two, three, four, five, six. Three, six. goodies but whatever charge the battery I really need I need to get that player train problems. anyway hello Uh, here, filter there. building gadget we'll put it on surface mode
goes in to Yeah. Right. Dang. right bricks from More diorite. Hold on. Uh... Where the hell? I know I'm going past a load of diorite, but I was mining out a huge chunk of diorite. Oh, that's how I got the diorite for the room. Finish that up. Uh, might have been there. Maybe I did already finish it then. Hmm. Huh. Must have. This, this, this is the problem when I don't play this game for a week. Like, uh, what was it doing? Where was it doing it? Uh, uh, I don't know. on the left and right. Start digging that out. The issue is that it goes by tag and not actual block. I can't just do this because it highlights all regular stone around it as well. Yeah, well, I have to deal with it. Although, I guess I could just use this. Yeah, good, good, okay. that doing? Thousand. I'll make sure I'm not getting to the limit. That would be a bit of a problem. So I'm gonna uh, get the null storage up upgraded. That's like emerald. So that's a lot.
Yep, yeah, we're up to full lit. Uh, we're up to 1400. In, damn it. There you go. That's a lot of diorite. Hell yeah, now we're talking. I thought we are seeing so much diorite. Good. Oh, oh best one. There you go. Uh, done now. Uh, two point six. to go mining at the top of the world or at least work out where the best place to go mining for them is specifically I know it's higher up right Let's see if it actually does work the way I think it should be able to oh. Grab this four ninety seven. Maybe use it. Yeah. Thing for the first.
It doesn't use it at all. Hmm. Sucks. Come on, I have infinite dirt, like right here. What are you doing? building one not building gadget that was uh, on the these things I don't remember to be honest with you pretty sure he's building ones gadgets oh so Diorite and the backpack. Walk bricks. Right. Yes. There goes that took you a second huh right this this don't want it Couple bricks.
that's good. Chucking it out like that. But... Marvelous. to grow into there and uh, it's all good. Case. There we are. Another room sorted. Don't know what we're going to do in this one. Too many things I need. Danya farming. Power generator. What I'm going to do for power general. Hmm. Right. Let's, uh, let's, let's deal with the oars. Yeah, okay. Try and push straight for the fire fuel. Need for those straws. It's the one. Yes. Casing, damn it. It's going to work for the hell to put this because I know it's fairly uh, power hungry. Right, and then what do we need? Um, oh, we need bamboo. Uh, have any? Don't have any, so we're gonna have to go back to the overworld. Can I hook this in here in it? No. 
Uh, which means I'm definitely not going to be able to hook it into this and it'd be okay. Yes, can. Oh, I'm hungry. Alright. Uh, we'll have to deal with that in... Find some bamboo. Boat. I don't have a boat. Some in the base. Stuff that's trying to kill me. with the night vision I can see underwater. Oh, 
backpack. Supply ship. Whoa. Uh oh, big boy, big boy. Run. Well, that is down there. This is why I didn't want to be on the ocean. Surprise, I am on the ocean. Wait, that anchor's not made of metal. No, of course not, why? Oh, pillagers! We boat and coming back for it later. Ugh! Oh god, the big boy's still following me. Fuck, fuck, fuck! Yep. Run! Run away very quickly! See that? See that? That's why we're not staying in the overworld. That's why we're not staying at that base. That we'd is stay in well. the overworld if that wasn't a problem. Oh, shut up, you. Zombies. Zappy Zappy! That it? Is that all you got? Cool. Thanks. I wanted some goddamn bamboo. That's all I want. But no! I have to cause problems! Of course. Hello, sheep. Thanks. crap. Yeah, I probably should have been a bit more careful with that, but... Uh,
Go away. <laughs> Idiots. Thank God, another gold backpack, damn. Busted bridge. Yep. Where is Hello? Bridge. It's probably the first one I've seen. Didn't have any bits missing. Prison mine cells. Prison stone. Whoa! Hello. Prisoners court Mine cell dead cells Oh 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 Max is not ready for this Probably not ready for this But you know what fuck it
Well, I've come up with something terrifying. So I've managed to use... Let's say, can you be a bit more specific? When not? I've got to create a boiler that's level 8. Which I'm using to run 8 alternators at full speed. That's which the is power generation. Powering three fraction of fractionating stills but i could do with more of them uh six laser drills and a fluid laser base which is getting oil which is being refined into refined fuel through the fractionating stills which is then powering more than the blaze burners with straws yeah that is that is a little bit uh Current excess bit, energy yeah. appears to be about 2,000 RF a tick. Which is not loads, but this is six laser drills with speed add-on twos in. And I'm producing way more oil than I need at the moment. Um, what sort of energy cube will tell me input-output, like exactly, per tick? Will the RF energy cells do it? But your limit will do it. No, I don't think they tell you one. I just want, like, because, you know, like, the Ender I.O. and I think the mechanism ones do as well. They give you a... Yeah. ...input-output. That knockback, idiot.
Ah, that'll do it, yeah. in a reasonable amount of emerald. Not an amazing amount, you know. Player deals more damage with each consecutive attack, max of 6.75 HP at 10 stacks, increases. Oh. Take enchantment. Keep the enchantment. Good. Um. Unless I find mending, in which case, uh, well, I mean, I'm still going to put it there, but. Great axe. Holding five. Pretty sure. Oh. Oh, go down. Let's stay up here for a sec. This, but... Ow. Rude. No. Bad. For that, I don't remember what the thing is. Ages since I played Dead Cells. I should play that again. I'm pretty sure I've got the Steam version as well, so I could get the whole Twitch interaction. Oh! Ow! Stop it! I figured out how to do stack towards wheels again. Hmm. 
like the uh, if you have them horizontally so that they are in the floor. I worked out to get them working. Okay. You have to alternate sides. So on the left hand side you have three blocks that are available for water. And then the next one up you go for the opposite side and go up one and then have the water run along that side. Because it only needs one side to be powered. Ah. Yeah, that that that'll do it. One gold backpack full. Mean entry, hold on. Diamond backpack. <laughs> Should probably go make some food in a minute. Uh, might be an idea, yes. Max. Off the top of your head, obviously I'm not going to make anything about research or anything, with the laser drills in Industrial Forgo, if it's full, do the lasers stop working and stop taking energy, or do they keep pumping um... in even though it can't grab any more? Currently, I'm using the fluid laser base. Does that have a visible internal tank? Yes, 32 millibuckets. Then 32, I believe millibuckets. it does stop. I could be wrong, but I believe it does. Okay. I'll leave it running while I'm getting food and we'll see. It's not like this is going to run out of power at any point. Given it's made a backlog of 26 buckets of refined fuel so far. The thing is, as well, is I'm wondering about this backlog because my oil is full. I could be processing stuff faster. Ooh. Oh, that's Trident. Damn it. That crowbar. Deals critical damage after breaking a door. So many enchantments for straddle bullets. Oh, next stage. I'm concerned because, like, I want. Okay. Oh, there you go. Return to Overworld.
Oh, of course, because this is this is one of the between ones, isn't it? I mean, that's why I can go home. Maybe. You're wrong. Or not. No, it's not. Ah, Fuck me, sideways. Came out of nowhere. Okay, maybe we will go back home because I am hilariously out of space. Hilariously, hilariously. Uh, we are absolute. Back off! I'm absolutely gonna mark that though. Um. Actually. Not there! Oh, I got a rune for it as well. Use on a doorway in the overworld to change its destination, so we can just start straight back there again. Cool. Yeah, I'll say something's amiss. I'm all the way up in the roof. Like, there's my staircase. I'm at Y73. I'm supposed to be at, like, minus summit or other. Some kids don't dig straight down.
Well, that was weird. the null storage. This is diamond blocks, okay. Which I can technically do. What the hell with it, let's do it. Next, four blocks of amethyst, four crying obsidian. And then, never yeah, stars. So, what do we got up to now? 262,000. Enchanted books. They'll all go in the Batani chest for now. Uh, first things first, I want the breaking. There we go, I'm breaking to That's gonna go. To be safe. Didn't find any mending books, which is slightly disappointing, but whatever. Uh, feather falling, I could do with that on boots. Not back, not back go any higher than two, I want. No, it doesn't. Above. Up back three. There we go. Let me break out. Pulling on boots. Wood. Right, now we're going to start dealing with all this nonsense. Um, good God, there's a lot of stuff. Um, that one's going to go in here because that's Batania. Uh, that's easy. Mob drop stuff. Uh, are technically food. Oh! Oh, I can... I can... Make more... Runes. Use the stone out of there, but let's grab some of that next time we run through. Chain can go in the tool one, I guess. Well, I have to get some standing upgrades. Paper for the nature one.
The mind cells. <sighs> Another set and put the uh, swords mod. You know what? You go there. Far in there. Uh. My ships don't stack. That's a pain in the ass. in here. I think the health flasks will keep in the main backpack. Just because why not, yeah. Uh the iron backpack. This if there's nothing in this, I'm just trashing it. Don't need those backpacks, got these ones. Eventually, we're going to end up with one of the libraries so that we can store all the enchantments in. But now, we're just going to have. I'm pretty sure the first library takes some ridiculous. Uh, yeah, infused shelves. Which means we need infusion with this nonsense, and we're not. Is the grass doing? The grass is uh Do I have a watering can. Ooh. Okay, hold on. Pretty sure and that but I 
Dr. Gore. Uh, Andrew, yes, never mind, I can do that. Right chest. One eye and two redstone. glass to that future as well. Don't have that on. You, you, and what do you mean no? Oh. Did craft the servo yet, did I? There we go. Now if we go find whichever enchanted book had holding five on it, we should be able to attach that to this. Yeah. Be able to hold 20 buckets to... 70. <coughs> Board. Can we change this again? Uh, not to change board. That, that, thanks, game. Thanks. Three, four. Cycle mode up, cycle mode down. Really? Do not. Oh, it's just these. Okay. Fair enough then. Good. 
and we watch as this uh, doesn't work. I hate being right, God damn it. Oh. No. Uh, oh, hey, I don't know. Maybe it's working? I don't freaking know. Doesn't look like it's working. There. Right, do we have a sink? No, we don't. We don't have cooking for blockheads. Uh, hmm. Okay. Um, um, attach that to this, then we just have to need a fix. I'm gonna go screw around over there. Um, oh, yeah, the acro secure. Hold on. So now we've got a way of getting water, and we need a way of wiping it. Use a create. Oh yeah, fluid arcs. What about those? Attachments called now because they used to be called servos as well. Servo, servo. The servo. Get away. Good man.
have to go there with that. That. 50? 50 should be fine, right? There's... I don't know what. Do you not fill this? Oh, charge fill. Is that gonna ah there you go okay yeah 50 is not awful it could absolutely be better but no. what was the turbo one needed invar and lead have any invar left i do uh So if the regular servo is 50, what's the turbo servo? Uh, oh, I'm going to need the crescent hammer, aren't I? Stop clipping that button. Turbo servo. Thousand up to eight thousand. Yep. Yeah. Alright. Man bronze now then. even tell. Look at that. Right. Let's go for the mana ring. I'm gonna have to s What? Have you now started giving a shit about why, what Y level I enter this thing on? Because you weren't doing that before. it's not not gonna be awful to fix I can just get a waste of right so if I stand on here now 
Uh oh. Yeah, okay. It's now started giving a shit, and I don't know why, and I'm now screwed because every time I go through here, it's gonna just... Every time I go through there, now I'm now just gonna fall straight now. Grab a water bucket, don't have one. I'm gonna have to start from, like, getting iron. It's gonna be difficult, because, you know, I lived here. So, I mined all the iron. Why now? This is what I don't understand. Why has it started giving a shit now? I'm gonna make a bucket of anything else. No, it's just iron. Okay. Chunks claimed, yeah, both ends. I hate this. I hate this fucking game. I hate this game. I don't like this game. Fuck. Why do I play this game again? Fucking... What? Oh yeah! Dev definitely doing that. Yeah. Just... 
Oh god damn it, no one was stuffs out thing. Ah. Unbelievable. Just in case. going back and forth, back and forth, moving all the stuff between the base, and there wasn't a problem, and now all of a sudden it decides to have a problem. Twice. And now it's fine. I just... I need for another waystone. Just in case. Stone four and a pearl. You have four and a pearl. Only four and a pearl. So. Alright. Uh, I've got the Minecraft soundtrack on uh, Winamp at the moment because I usually listen to uh, royalty free music on Pretzel, but Pretzel's been having issues with the capital ish, so because uh, I'm playing Minecraft, I can play the Minecraft soundtrack. Yeah, what is it? Uh, 11, the end, and 5. 13, not 11.
And you can go back in there. Alright, uh... That's nearly... Now we've got to work out what the hell we want to do. Farm wise. Because we can just do, you know, regular old Minecraft farms, do it manually for now. Um. Or. We can maybe look at doing create. Maybe look at doing. Um. Industrial four going. That's the one. That's fine, yeah. Um, we do regular farms. They're what? Nine by nine, but 25. So we'd only be able to fit four in each. Um, wanting to do a bigger one, we'd need at least a ring around the middle. Uh, ring around the edges and between each farm, so we'd want... Say we did a one wide, but... Just bits and giggles, I guess. So we'd need one, then nine to ten, one, nine, ten. Thirty-one by thirty-one. I mean, isn't far off what we've got now, because what we've got now is 25. Ideally, though, we'd want a three-wide gap if we were doing... Um... Industrial foregoing farming machines. If we did create with the gantry or with a contraption, we could absolutely do it with a one wide gap. I mean, hell, we don't have to leave a gap if we're doing that, but you know, on a gap, so I can put lighting in, you know. Um. We could just stick to four farms and pile them up a bit, I guess. Because, I mean, it's... So if we did this as a farm, we'd have one, two, and then another one. One, two, and then... We could stack at least two on top of each other. Maybe not a third. Third wouldn't be good. That, that gives us three high gap between each one. And then in one of these room, like one of these room spaces without having to do much at all, we can fit eight farms. Honestly, we'd probably have to do it like that because we'd have to plug the water in anyway. Some of these things are too high, so we'd need the third block space to block the water off. Or we could just do things like 
the hydroponics. It's gonna take a bit, but that is doable at least. But we're gonna need animal farms as well. Um Hmm. I know we've got cloches. But, you know, then we've got to start getting into immersive engineering and... Bamboo. I never did find bamboo, did I? Damn it. Um... think it was but I had to check because you know too many mod packs just all sort of blur together to do create we'd need create power which shouldn't be too difficult because you know gantry stuff isn't too um stress hungry probably pff, probably be able to get away with water wheels just powering that so we can keep it isolated and i don't have to run power all the way from you know yeah over there to over here or wherever the hell the farm thing's gonna be I do kind of want to keep the rooms all the same size, so if I want, I can just put corridors between all of them and have them all linked together. You know, if we did do the same size, we could then do, like I said, we can have it split into two layers. Then, then it would be. Let's get let's get this out. Can start with me. We do. We're sticking with the same size and not making it any bigger, just to keep it all. And we can have a three wide ring, so it'd be one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Two. Four, five, six, seven. Nine and yeah, okay. Hmm. Have three on the outside and one in the middle. That's fine. Okay. So two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. That would be the shape of the the actual like dirt. in and what have you, but, um, I mean, that way then we could do either or, because we'd have three around the outside, we could quite easily fit in, you know, the, um, industrial foregoing machines, or leave it as it is and run a create thing through the middle. Gives us the most options, at least. Um... Yeah, so... We'll leave it for that, then. We'll do it that size. 
At least then I also then don't have to uh, fiddle with making different size room. I picked up more dirt, hooray. Um, Oh, God. Bonk. Hello, dear. Hoi. You missed the fun. Did I? Uh, what did I miss? Fucking uh, Mining Dimension Teleport decided it gave a shit about what Y level I was uh, being put in on. Did you suddenly end up on the surface? No, there is no surface. Oh, okay. I ended up uh, suffocating in a wall uh, 90 odd blocks up. Oh. So I dug down to try and find this place. Which I did, you know. And then when I went back through it, decided to put me in a cave, uh, you know, at this level. So, you know, about 90 odd blocks down in the overworld. I came back, and all of a sudden, I'm now falling down the 90 block hole I dug. And I died. So I had to grab my spare pickaxe that I thankfully left over there. Uh, to go mine some iron, mine some stone, make a furnace. Make a bucket. Try and fucking MLG it or whatever. And I come back through and it's fine and it just puts me there. Because <laughs> of course. Because of course. So yeah. I went and got my corpse. I put the bucket of water down at the bottom of the hole. So if it does bring me back again... I've got a four block deep water thing to fall into and I should hopefully not get dead. But I've also put a waystone in it. A waystone in it as well, so I've got an alternate way of getting out of here. Also, I have an answer. What? The laser drills will not stop. Ah. It's full. They will just keep pushing. Oh well. You just make a redstone circuit condition that says if this tank that I've attached to it is more than X full, stop it. Yeah, but that would require actually doing a setup. Mm. This is very much what can I get away with in a tiny area to test if this works. Mm. But yeah, so you can totally use the oil you get from a fluid laser base um, to power the fluid laser base and everything to make the fuel and the oil with lots of excess. I need to figure out what I want to do for power. Like, to get started. Because solar's out, obviously, being in here. Yeah. I cannot recommend alternators as an, as an option. Mm. This works just because of the stupid amount of energy density of the oil. Alternators are not a good power source overall. No. Dynamos? Do dynamo? Especially if you're oh, looking to set up making like auto charcoal. Yeah, sterling one would be great for that. We've got sterling, which is solid fuel. Compression, which is liquid and... Um... Oh, no, it's just liquid. 
Magmatic is lava. Numismatic is money. Lapidary is gemstone. Disenchantment is enchanted stuff. And Gourmand is food. Yeah, bank of those with um, augments, components. The thing is, if you start making biofuel for your steam boiler, you can always add on some compression dynamos for the excess. Oh, hmm? no. no. Tree oil, creosote, refined fuel, or biodiesel. Oh, well. That's it. Go with refined fuel, then. <laughs> yeah. Gotta find oil first. Do you mean, technically I don't have to, because I know where there is some. But, no. Because that's in the ocean. As we've seen repeatedly, the ocean does not like me. Yeah. And unfortunately, to get oil for the fluid laser base, you do have to be in some sort of ocean. Oh, really? Yeah. Mm. In fact, you can't even be in all of the oceans, because I don't think war motion counts. Yeah, it's ocean, cold ocean, deep cold ocean, deep frozen ocean, deep lukewarm ocean, or warm ocean. Lukewarm ocean? No. Deep ocean? Just deep, plain deep ocean? No. Oh, has it happened? It's happening! What? That's you. Stardew Valley 1.6 is here! Hooray! Do still needs to beat Skyrim. Do? <laughs> Go beat up the dragon. Honestly, given how big of an update it is, I'm surprised how small the space requirement is. Like, the update is 54 megabytes. Pretty sure most of the update is code, not sprite changes. True. I wouldn't know. I'm not looking. I'm not looking at the changelog. Uh, I've looked at the update available now, which doesn't have a changelog. Yeah, no, but I've looked at that bit. Yeah. Like, new major festival, mini festivals, new environmental event, hundreds of lines of new dialogue, new end game skill system, new crops, crafting items, furniture, new farm type, multiple pets, and way more. I don't want to spoil anything. Because all that shit we already knew already. Also, you know, the one thing that le got left out of that part, you can now drink mayonnaise. But why? why? Yeah. That's what I was like. I was just like, oh, I, I, it's like I went to the... Because he's, he's been revealing one non-spoilery patch note every day for like the last week. And it's like, I've made, you know, it's a little thing, you know, you go have a look at what you got this time. So I was like, oh, I'm going to go see what the patch note is for today. 
And now Drake Mayor, what the fuck? Yeah, I see a Stardew Valley playthrough in Max's future. Not immediate future. No, not immediate future. Unfortunately, I do not have the time between now and next month to do all that. I suspect if Max is playing with me that I don't know what's going to happen and that's he's going to hand me a fishing rod and point at the water. No. I don't tell you to do fishing, you just fuck off and do it! It's bad. When was the last time I told you to go fishing when we played Stardew? After you'd already done a ton of it. Uh, yeah, to be fair, you did tell me after I'd done some because we yeah. needed more money. Exactly. It is what kickstarts the farm, though. Oh, yeah. No, maybe, maybe at some point, but I don't know. I doubt it. We shall see. Make Star do it. Like I said, not make Star do it. Star do? Star do it, yeah. I got it. I'm, I'm not that asleep. I, I did get that. I caught it. You, you're good. Oh, so you can do fishing now if you caught it. <laughs> Shut up. This is why Max was sort of glad I wasn't on voice for a while. Nah, I've missed having someone to talk to, to be honest with you. You mean you don't talk to your demons? I talk to mine. No, they tend to just shout at me. Yeah, mine tend to run away if I talk too long. Yeah, good for you. Mine just sort of don't do that. It'd be nice if they did, but... Right, uh, what was I doing? Oh, yeah, power. Um, or you could go power. Yeah, that's what I was looking at before you suggested dynamos. Because we've got what? The Furnator is basically a sterling dynamo. But we can scale that a bit further because that goes up to 40,000. That takes a lot to get to the 40,000, but it can do 40,000. Um, Magmator is lava. So. Can do, but probably not. Thermo is temperature differentials. Think. No, wait, no. The thermo in this one is it sits on top of a heat source and you pump water in it to cool it down. I remember now. The temperature differential is the immersive engineering one. Yes. Uh, then you've got solar have. panels. Yeah, I do have that. We've got solar panels that we can't use. And then we've got reactors, which I've never used. We don't have a good source of uranite in this one. Mm, not really. But like uh, 20 raw uraninite from all the mining I've done so far. So, uh, not a lot, no. Um... Flux networks. Right, we don't have flux networks, so if I want to do wireless charging, we've got to do power. Which, to be fair, I was going to do it that way for a bit anyway. I don't think power charges the Curio slot, unless that's changed. I have to check later when I've actually got the stuff together for. Um, so... 100 yeah. iron, so I can technically get started with the dynamos. Because they're just mostly iron heavy. At least the sterling ones are. Um... Oh, you have alchemistry. God. Please, no. Oh, the thing, the things I can do with alchemistry. That's right. I'm going to go add uh, stone to the blasting filter. There's not a way that I can just access the filter while it's sat in there is there I have to pull it out. Uh, as far as I know, yes, you have to pull it out. Okay. Unfortunately. No, no, it's fine. I'm just making sure I'm not, you know, missing something here. I also do wish I could see the filter while it was in there, so I could go, oh yeah, I'm missing that in there while it's running. I 
hours. We've gone around the whole sale trailer. It's like five hours. What are we at now? Yeah, five and a half hours nearly. Damn. So that was that was a far less impressive feat going through the whole soundtrack before I found all the uh, stuff beyond Alpha and Beta soundtracks. Be farm set up and running a little sad. I can't just power level myself with farming the spawners. Ah. Mm, no, I'd probably thought of that. I was going to say, what about using, like, uh, crushing wheels to kill them and then using the uh, nuggets of experience to get the XP? I don't know if that counts. Washing one again. I need to label these. Signs, I guess. We have washing, uh, haunting, smoking, and plastic. There we go. Good. We are going to have to sort out farms fairly quickly though, because I'm running out of peanut butter. I mean, to be fair, we do still have the peanuts growing in the overworld, but... Thank you! Right, let's go grab a whole bunch of iron. And redstone and gold. we say? Uh, eight to start, I guess. There we go. Eight dynamo. Now comes the question of where the hell do we want to get this set up? Like, assuming that we're going to be doing it in here with this stuff, because we can share the power. Um, uh, ooh, that one. Can't use the AoE to kill them, you have to hit them. Uh -uh. It's got AoE, it should count. It sucks. You generate 40. Okay, so this generates double the base value of ours thing on the wall. Uh, Burnator. So if we get. What's called? Thingies. Luck stuck. Luck stuck. Oh, that's fairly simple. Okay. I'm gonna get four. Do you, do you use eight of those? Eh, whatever. Not like we're hurting for lead or redstone. Glass okay. might be a problem. But okay, I'm scared now. 
I have found a method to use water, iron, phantom membranes, and meat to make uranium. Because alchemistry is my sort of thing. Okay then, Max. Run this by me again. Okay, so you combine hydrogen and iron to get cobalt. You combine nitrogen and what was the other one called? Um, it's again with C. Anyway, you get it from breaking down uh, phantom membranes. And the nitrogen, yeah, cerium, which you get from phantom membranes, and nitrogen, which comes from protein. Uh, and then you combine those two together, and they make uranium. It's a lot of fusion controller work, which I think might be quite power-hungry, but it's doable. Okay. I'm just... No. I'm walking away from that one. Like, ah, oh, yeah, there's, there's a whole bunch of stuff. Now we can make uranium. Ooh. Right, we need... Some... What else can we do with charcoal? Uh, to make them charcoal. It literally just... Get the ash from ice and fire can't make. Good. Coke oven, redstone furnace, multi silver press, pyrolyzer. It's the coke oven because we get creosote out of that and can't we use creosote in... can use creosote in a compression dynamo. It's not amazing. Can do. The only issue we got there is that it's slow unless we get the pyrolyzer, but then the pyrolyzer takes power, so that kind of just defeats the other. Um. I don't know how I'm gonna do trees. Like probably gonna have to do another room like this, but make it I think what I may do is I may do a create contraption to harvest the trees. But use a planter from Industry 4 going to plant them. Just so then I don't have to screw around with making sure that the contraption's got saplings all the time. That's usually the biggest pain in the end. What's a planter cost? Uh, plant 
something or other. Plant solar, there we go. Uh, pitiful machine frame. Okay, yeah, that's all stuff I can do right. Well, say right now, I think I just need to smelt some clay, get bricks, but that's about it. Uh, yeah, that means that's going to need power first, but I mean, kickstart. So the best thing to do for that is going to be... be a windmill? I don't know. Like, what else do you do, maybe? What? Like, the rotational stuff. It's a shaft in a bearing, isn't it? Yeah, so that's uh, a rotational powering bearing. Powering it with rotational bearing, okay. Yeah, wind bearing, mechanical bearing, and clockwork bearing. So I'm assuming hey, it's the mechanical, mechanical one. Mechanical one is the one you want. Yeah, that's the one. Hmm. I mean, we've got power ending over there. So I can quite easily just make another room this side. Well, I say this side. This length and width through there. Run that through the wall. I mean, I have to go under to... Ah, uh, wait, no. Uh... Wait, no, I, don't, I, I, I can do it from any direction, can't I? So I can do it from the ceiling. I mean, that'd be stupid. Uh, well, hmm. What do I have to do if it soars? It's just the lowest... Like, it's the bottom block, isn't it? Cut everything down. Yes, so as long as it cuts the last block between uh, the floor and the rest of the tree, it'll cut the tree down. Because the planter's got to go in the floor. I can't get around that. What I might have to do is dangle the saws down from the ceiling. Bring it down like that, and then obviously once it gets to the bottom, bring it out like that, have it rotate around this. Because then I can have the planter in the floor under and in, in planter in the floor in the middle under the grass. Because it has to be one block lower. So I'm going to need a load of saws, I'm going to need a load of shafts, I'm going to need a load of casings. I am going to need a load of logs. this through the saw blade, but the saw blade's set to get planks out of it and not cause problems. 
You know, these ones don't have planks, but, you know. Well, oh, not through the sword blades, anyway. Right, so that'll get me a stack of andesite casing. I mean, I am gonna need to get some more andesite alloy again. I've got a couple of stacks still, so it's not like I need it right now, but... Sooner rather than later. There's the casings. Uh, swords. Mechanicals. I can't spell. Mechanical sword. Uh, that is iron sheet. So, how big is this again? It's like 12? Close. Yeah, 12 to the wall. So, if we did. Just do half a stack just to, you know. So I need stack and a half of eight. Right, so let's grab some fuel so that we can uh, kick the boiler into going faster. Where's the rest of the Kelp blocks. I must have used them all. Damn. Okay. For that plant, then, huh? Uh, smashy thing. Yeah, we're speeding this fucker up. Give me fuel. More oh, like it. Stack of iron, and a half stack of the casing that I just made. Half a stack of sauce. Uh, so then we need a mechanical bearing, uh, a slab. Casing and a shaft. There's a mechanical bearing. Um, I'm gonna need um meat. What's the things that you connect to create things to pull the stuff out of them? Are the funnels? No, from contraptions there. 
Oh, the portable um, in interface, whatever they are, inventory interface. Ah, portable energy, portable fluid, portable storage and That's the one. Casing and shoot. Those. Okay. Um... Shafts we've got, casings we've got. Chain drives we've got, cog we've got. Um, pretty sure that's everything. We just need we just need it to spin in place. Soul blades themselves don't need any energy. Literally just all gotta go into the bearing. Glue. Don't think I've made any of them. Uh, a plate, a nugget, and two slime balls. Nugget. Plate. Slime balls. Um bleh. oh god. I think glue was a uh load bearing quest. Yeah, it sure was. What's this? The mechanical piston, cart assembler, a sticker, clockwork bearing, radial chassis, contraption controls, gantry carriage and elevator pulley. Dirty sheet. Eh, brained, yes. Ish. Not quite soon, but, you know. Ooh. Great, Crafts and Additions has an accumulator? Huh. Multi-block storage, uh, energy storage. Yeah, I'm sure is what it says. Okay. Fair enough. Uh Okay then. So let's put those into the gold backpack. Black wood box. Right. Box ball. Is it? Damn it. Middle by three, so it wall and then one, two, five. Next one, so then that goes like that, that goes like that. Okay. Twenty-five. One, two, three, four, five, the wall. Wait, no, that's Hang on, nearly fucked it. Now it should be putting for one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, 
10, 11, 12, 18, 19, 20, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So twelve, four, five, six, seven, eight, twelve, three, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay. That's how big this usually is. So we're gonna wanna make words. We're gonna wanna make this we grow. Honestly, probably it's gonna go with oak, but grow fairly huge. One by one column, I'm going to restrict to space at least four blocks above it. Sapling. Uh, okay, we're not doing flowers in there, so it shouldn't generate bee nests. That's good, I hadn't thought of that. Um. More modern uh, medicine stuff to go, so I'll be back in a bit. Okie dokie. Say... How high? It says how much space they need to be able to grow, but it doesn't say how high they can. Oh, 
Oh, here we go. Uh, Sapling requires 4 to 14 blocks of open space directly above and otherwise being closed on all sides. Okay. Fourteen, so we need to freaking double the size of this room. Oh boy. Um well, we need to double the height of it at least. They don't have to be, it doesn't have to be that tall, but like at the same time, it's like, wrong way. same time, it's like we might as well give it, you know, the maximum chance to grow. God, I'm gonna need so many diorite bricks. Uh, how the hell do I even wanna. What is it for a destruction gadget? Damn it, I need ender poles. Uh, okay. It's just going dark, so... Go find some endermen. Love it if I had looting on this, but I don't. Do I? No. But not back three now, though, so that's gonna be hilarious. It's like, ah, yes, you're here trying to hurt me. Bap. Bye! I love that there's still, you know, ice and snow around here, just purely because I haven't been in this area since it turned spring. And it hasn't had a chance to go away yet. Hello? Hello? Goodbye! I don't think they're in this biome. Yeah, if you want to be stu- He's having fun. Oh yeah, knockback three's uh, got some kick to it, damn. I realise that's the point, but you know. Oh, 
Endman. Tower as well. I might find some uh, good loot. Probably not, but you know. That was the way in. Got that one. Uh, take another anvil. Uh, ew. Whoa! Thank you very much. Locko Diamond. it for up here. Let's see what was downstairs. Yep. <laughs> God damn it. Did you drop a thing. Craft these? Oh, craft them all in there. Well, I guess that uh, we'll just have to look. Loot sucks. Enderman, where are you? Daytime. Mm. 
Don't go daytime, I'm not ready yet. Eh. No. I ain't dealing with your nonsense again. Apparently I am. Hold then. No, you don't. You ain't stealing my food. My food. Alone. <laughs> that no. Cyclops, uh, mound things. Hi, loot sucks. Yeah, he looked a bit stuck. Oh yeah, you're totally stuck. Taking these bone blocks. You know, somehow more worth it than for actual. Oh, goodbye. Skelly horse. Come back to what they spawn. Kind of do, but you know. Oh, 
Still new. I'm back. Time for more science. Yeah, I got a weapon I can throw as well. Kinda. Seriously, how many of you have tridents? This is ridiculous. Many of you. Thank you, dear. Don't ask silly questions. Because they'd be a lot more reasonable if they dropped one. Uh, they. Listen how you uh did beforehand, but now just no. Goddamn snow. Damn it! Come oh, over the damn thing. What does this do? Uh, chance on hit to absorb nearby souls, toughening and slowing the attack speed of the wielder. And right click, release souls, transferring the attack speed, debuff to nearby foes, and regenerating them. Stay. Wait, not. Found the third eye. How many do we need? It's like 12, isn't it? Yeah, 3 by 4. Hmm. 
all of these? What did I do here? Ah, okay. Find one of each of the uh, three things. I kind of want to tear this down because I want the bridge. You have all of that. Good. Is it going to look a mess? Yes. Do I care? No. And we're near where I uh, living, so... Now, however, we're going to have to get some mana going when I get home. This is... Uh, Goes from a pickaxe to take a bit of a beating. By a bit, I mean. Ha <laughs> ha ha, boy. Got less than half a bar of mana left.
keep going. Night time again, so we might be able to find some endermen. You missed. Ah, manuscript. That's better. Need that. You're just ignoring him and stealing his stuff. Yeah. Fine, he can't read. Definitely better loot than last time. Still question why he's just leaving you alone. Hmm. You're not supposed to be passive. I mean, to allow. Right. <laughs> Oops, I forgot about those. He's unpleasant. Skeleton on me at last, so... Did it ever stop firing arrows? Pretty much. Jasper. What? The uh, book material. Ah. Reddish kind of stone. I thought that was the name of the creeper thing you were fighting. That's a beach creeper. Where did he go? Because I don't see. John. Okay. I think he fell in a hole. Very lucky he can stay. Not good. No visible. Normally means an invisible chest, doesn't it? Either that or I've uh, been him. Yes, would. I would say check the map, but you can't do that, can you? the gold block of out of it.
absolute zero knock. Like, ah, yes, knockback three. How about no? Graveyard. Hey, Max. I have refined my technique. Okay. Nether water and iron I can turn into uranium. Low weapon. I think Duke's gonna want to run down. <laughs> okay. So in alchemistry, um, if you break down a nether wart, you get a chitin, four selenium, and four germanium. If you combine a germanium and an iron, you get a cerium. And if you combine a cerium and a selenium, you get a uranium. Two of those things have come from the nether wart. One of them has come from iron. <laughs> and you have some chitin left over that I'm not entirely certain what you're doing. So yeah. Hi. Okay there. Yeah.
Thunder Pearls, I want. Find the bathhouse. And found a bathhouse. God, it keeps coming. Going and going and oh god. Wait, where's the door? Found the door. There's a whole bunch of something in here. Several something by the sound of it. Was a trip wire. What it was attached to, because apparently it's got a hook off the floor. And another couple. Okay. Yeah. 
Hello. Ah. Can't see shit. Boy. Boy. A bit stuck. I look a bit stuck. I look a bit dead. Is that it? Does not look like there was anything else. Okay. How the hell did I get out of here? No way to go up. Did I come on? Ah. Please in as best as we can. 
Yes. That's concerning. I'm really hoping there's lava off in that direction. There's a ladder over there, which to an airship, I imagine. Find out, apparently. Um. And uh, this is all good. Let's go there. Yeah. Plus, I've got a bunch of the uh, runic tablet stuff uh, repairing me all near if we don't find mending. Right? Which is handy. Oh, 
Okay, I do. See what my uh, goat horn sounds like. Didn't make a noise. Uh, is that because? Another eye. Got one side of the uh, portal finished at least. Find the damn thing. Leather armor as well. Some, it's not enchanted with anything, so bye bye. Anything else in here that I can do that with? Uh, you, you, bows we don't need. Uh, that leather helmet literally has no durability. Bye. Uh, you, you've got an enchantment on. So do you, so do you, so do you. You. Stone axe can go a bit beyond that. Trident gets to stay solely because it's the only one we've got at the moment. Is there anything in here that shouldn't be in here? Uh, potions, we've decided to going to go in the magic chip. Now. Okay. Good. Mm. <laughs> oh, excuse me. I think that's all of it. Yep. And you've just got the stuff I need for the stuff. Right, so now we can make the construction get. So, more iron, two redstone, lapis, and two end. Right, what we'll also do is we'll also. 
turn off the battery so it doesn't charge off of that. Oh, wait, we can't anyway, never mind. I'm gonna say, we don't want it to charge off the battery, and then I just suddenly realized I can't charge it in the uh, energy cell. I can only charge the battery in the energy cell. Right, you are gonna need some fuel. Uh, what do we need to turn you into a better one? Six diamonds, two glass. Easy peasy. Next. Emeralds. Obsidian, but that needs blaze rods. No, okay. We'll leave. We'll leave it at emerald for now. Although, like, what? Uh, no, fine. We know there's a blaze spawner, so we can just go get some more blaze rods, I guess. It's fine. Right, so we go there, you have this, uh, output to the right, and do that. There we go. Yeah, look how fast that's charging. Nice. That's done. That can go back on my head. Apparently where it's sitting. Right, uh, wait, no, no. Did that one already, this one. Right, so we'll do this probably a layer at a time. Uh, so we want depth of one. Slightly smaller area. Oh, hello, Diamond. Yeah, we're going to be grabbing you in a minute. One layer. I think what I may do is just go for grab. So uh, if we've done one, that'll be two, three, four, five, six, seven. Excuse me. Seven, eight, nine, ten, 
11, 12. Yeah, that's correct. Good, 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 good. Okay. We are gonna need a hell of a lot of die right bricks. There we go. So that's, that's, that's a lot. And how are we for power? Just need to use a million already. Alright, let's go uh, drop this back in here then. Are you done? Oh god. Gonna need more power. Okay. Um. Up more fuel, not more power. Oh yeah, we do. More charcoal! More charcoal. Your face. These are also uh, mostly planks. Three, four, blocks, there you go. Whatever, it's fine. Give me a hopper, I'll just run out of planks for now. I like I can do a whole lot with these planks anyway. Where the hell's the hopper gone? Front fuel. Up. Uh, 
It's a little bit more, but it's not a whole lot more. Absolutely gonna have to uh, get the uh, food farm up and running after the tree farm. But we're gonna get a lot of diorite brick. Um, need to do two rooms worth of diorite brick. We have 2,000 though, so we should be okay, I think. Okay, uh, now we need brick. How many of those to be? Uh, 1.64, that's fine. That's still the same size. Right, now I'm going to do the floor. That's going to be the difference. Barely any dirt. Don't like using this, do you? Pain in the ass. Deal with the blocks that go first. And no, right. Can't do that.
So yeah, using a hardened reactor and blue ice, I have managed to get a power positive process using alchemistry. Using a what reactor? A, a hardened reactor. Third tier? I want to say third tier, because I think it's starter Base, basic hardened. Starter basic hardened, yeah. So it's not even all that difficult. Literally the first tier that needs um, energizing stuff. Wait, what am I doing? Oh. God, where is it? There it is. There's a bug. What? Um, so it turns out um, if you accidentally shift right click a reactor, it um, kind of uh, breaks because you pick up one of the reactor blocks before you should be able to. Why would you shift click a reactor? I was flying and trying to go down and check the reactor at the same time. I mean, then it's also an easy fix, you know, you just blacklist the uh, reactor stuff from carry on. Can we stop with the constant storming on this seed? No. Literally every three in game hours. It has decided to start storming, and it's like, can can we not? No. Suffer. Storming. That's a bit better. Uh, I'm gonna leave it empty for now. As I actually get around to moving the canyon today. Not likely, but you know. I'm afraid it's really not at this point. Uh, given the fact that it's already going on for quarter past nine.
I say while I'm filling in, might as well be uh, slowly changing into the uh, vibrant grass of the grass of it. Welcome back to. There we go, okay. That's the tree farm room. Oh, I'm gonna have to work out lighting. I mean, I might just have to give up a few spaces and keep the torches. I mean, it's like that, give up a few space, give a few, give up a few spaces for torches or give up a few spaces to embed lights in the floor. So either way, I'm losing those spaces. Maybe you're still testing. Uh, yes, why? Uh, can you put a max tier size upgrade in a planter? Tell me how big that area is. Please and thank you. That plant sour? Uh, yeah, sorry. And it's range 12 is the max, isn't it? Whatever is emerald. 12. Okay. Unless they've, unless they've added one that's uh, further. Uh, no. I'm pretty sure these are like. Yeah, not the right ones. I need green dye for that. Uh, it is a radius 13, including the block at the center. That's the entire space. Damn. That is quite literally the entire space. Holy crap. That's going to be 20, a lot of trees. It's 25 by 25. Yeah, 20. That's, that's the exact size of these rooms. That's going to be a lot of trees. Um, you said it was more fans to get things to smelt faster, didn't you? Yes. What happens if it's charcoal but doesn't get to the box like if i do fans on a belt and now it if it's blasts charcoal, to charcoal it'll just, unless it has another smelting recipe it will get deleted gets deleted yeah so oh. the thing with bulk smelting is if it has a smelting recipe the bulk smelting will smelt it but if it doesn't have a bulk smelting recipe it will just destroy it 
It does take a little bit to do it. It takes exactly the same amount of time as it would to otherwise smelt the thing. Right. But it will just go, no. So what I'm going to want then is probably to smelt it on depots. Uh, what happens if it's on a depot and it doesn't all get off the depot? Does it stop? Again? No, or does it, it doesn't keep stop. going? It would keep going until it was completely furnaced and deleted. Um, the best thing you can do a lot of the time is do it on a depot and have a whatever the, the clutches and basically have a comparator that goes right once yeah. this is full stop, stop the fans yeah or stop the fan uh, I hadn't thought of that one yeah I was just going to stop the uh, items getting put on the depot that works too though yeah, the stopping it on the depot works fine. I do normally do fans because that means anything that's on the depot that I want will still drain through and it will only turn the fans on once the depot is empty and the items have dropped enough. Ah, uh, that makes sense. Yeah. Um... Doing it this way is definitely going to be better if, if we do it by blasting. I mean, technically we can saw blade it, can't we? Shit, thinking about it. Because we're doing oak saplings. We'd get more fuel for doing it mm. for um, planks. You would. They just don't last as long in the sense of so the arm would have to move more. I mean, isn't really that much of a problem. I wonder if I could speed the arm up one stage. All I should have to do is put a big cog wheel there, right? Like, and that'd speed up one stage because yep. it's technically a small. Hold on. Doesn't work. It doesn't work. We haven't really lost anything. No, you haven't lost anything. Like, there's not even anything on the depot currently to put there. You know. No, no, I'm more talking like we're not going to lose resources by breaking these things. Yeah, no, you're not. Whoops. Oh, man. About that. Uh, yeah, that's that. Yeah. I want that to force around Robin as well. Max. What? What's up? You broke the mechanical belt. Right. You didn't need to, because if you right-click the end of a mechanical belt with a wrench, it goes back one space. If you right-click a mechanical ah. the end of a mechanical belt with a belt, it extends one one space. Oh, you bastard! God damn it, mate! Did you break it again? No, I don't have any belt on me. Oh, I see. Okay. I didn't know you could take it back down one by doing that. I knew you could extend it by clicking it with the belt, but I didn't know you could take it back down. Yeah. Again. So you can. You and can I figured uh, must be able to, but yeah. All right. So that's definitely. That's definitely quicker. Yeah. Should see what it looks like at full speed. Terrifying. Yeah, full speed is a little bit silly. It's the sort of thing uh, you feel like if you put your hands in it, you're going to end up trapped in something. Planks. I just want to see how much faster it is. I know it's not going to be a whole ass load faster, but, you know. So long as it gets through all nine of them before they start, you know. 
running out. Yeah. By quite a bit. Maybe you didn't even need to speed it up. No, I'd rather have had the buffer. Yeah. Because, I mean, yeah. the thing is that that had all nine at once. Doesn't it... Oh, no, wait, no, because if I use the brass one, I can tell it how many... Drop yeah, you it. can tell exactly how many to put on there, so it'll only extract if it has that much to put on the depot. I guess we're saw blading it then. Looks like. You can make the saw guide go stupid fast as well. Wouldn't have to do too much either. I could just bring that belt down one and then go, oh look. Saw blade there, saw blade here, chain drives. Um some form of storage thing, probably a drawer or one of those limited Barrel thing in the what's it's from Sophie yeah. and done. And the nice thing there is the store blades will also stop when they're full. You don't exactly. need to worry about that. Yeah, that was the other thing. Just like I was, I was thinking about it, I'm just like, no, we can't do that because we're not using anything that can go on the saw blade. And then I just suddenly realised, wait a minute, yes, we are. We're using the oak ones now. Okay. Uh, how do we want to do this then? Um, I know I can't get this going yet because we don't have power. We don't have anything, but I need to like. I think it's going to have to be like a radial, like a single arm rather than double one. Yeah. Bamboo on BCG plus. Right. Just so I don't need fifty saws. I mean, I made thirty-two. Two of those are now spoken for to turn the things into planks. That leaves thirty. I'd need to make another twenty, which means I'd need a bunch more iron. You have a bit more. Well, if you're doing a square, the best you could do is instead of doing something that rotates. Right. I suppose you'd still you'd need two sets of saws for that one. Um, I was thinking you could do one of the rotary shafts that just goes back and forth. The gantry. The gantry, yes. Yeah. Yeah, I'd need even more saws then because I'd have to go all the way across the whole thing. Oh, wait, no, because the whole thing's 25, is it? Never mind. Never mind. No, I can do two, can't I? Yeah. Five radius. Five diameter. Ah! Um, yeah. I think it's about that time. <laughs> but the plan the plan's going to be is that we'll do... Actually, where's, where's that clipboard? Board. The board. Right, we're, we're, we're gonna. Right, okay, so, to do. I'm gonna scratch my eyes, there we go. Ugh. Uh, do can I put like a title on that? Or is this a title? Right, to do. Uh, tree farm. Uh, what's it called? The, um, contraption. Yeah. Tree farm harvest contraption. Uh, basic power for plant sower. Uh, what can we make? Plant sower. Don't have one of those yet. And then we want the basic power. Um, twin sawmills for 
uh, oak log to planks. The other thing we're going to have to worry about is what else we get from the farm. Because we're going to be getting what? Twigs, sticks, apples, acorns. Saplings. Saplings we don't have to deal with. Saplings are going back around the system. I'm talking stuff we're not going to be using. Yeah, and when you have excess saplings, what are you going to do? No, no. I'm talking like stuff that's not being used. So I'm not counting oak logs and I'm not counting saplings. I'm talking stuff that's going to sit okay. in the box. Like, not stuff that's going to go round again or get used. I mean, okay, sticks will probably get used for something, but I'm talking, like, for the farm itself. We're talking, like, what, four extra things? Uh, storage for additional items from tree farm. Um, item transportation... that's it then, isn't it? Once we've got all the items moving around, the boiler's going to go full pelt. Yep. Because 3x3 three three is the biggest one we can do, isn't it? The, yes. Uh, boiler. Yep. So a level 18 is the biggest boiler you can have. Yeah. And we're already, like, halfway there on heat. Yeah, you all will have a max size 9 boiler because you won't be superheating yet. Oh, sodded. Curios, add. Add. Me. One. Put my goggles on and have all the rest of it on as well. This is why I liked it when there was a, go a specific goggle slot. So, oh wait, no, we're maxed out. We're maxed out on water. When all of these are going with what we're gonna give them, we're gonna be half capacity on heat. I okay. need to make more tanks because at the minute we're level six, so this is one yep. third of the size. So we need nine, eighteen, twenty-seven, fifty-four more tanks, which is what six more in height. So it's gonna poke through the roof, whatever. And then how many did? How much did you say we needed? For the engines? Uh, one per level. So if you're having a l 18... So that's fine. That's fine. They'll still fit in here. All I have to do is poke the, boil the boiler tanks through the roof a bit. Yes. That's fine. Because I can easily fit three, another 3x3 three three there and then hook that in with this. No problem. Yeah. Now, I don't know how useful this will be because you've got the extra crate mods installed as well, but something to keep in mind as well if you need it is mm -hmm. each of the steam engines... Yeah. Uh, can overstress individually as long as they are not connected to the same network. Yes, got it. Yeah, so I can have the 3x3 three three on like the opposite side and they can do what they want with the other thing. Yeah, and they can, that can be two separate networks. Yeah. Not that we can do that with how I've got the rooms laid out, but pff, whatever. I'm fine. just making you aware of it. Oh, yeah, yeah, no, that's fine. Uh, I mean, this is still going to be super temporary because eventually we're going to be running it off of biofuel. Yeah. I think about that one for a minute. Um, the other thing we're going to have to work out then is where we're going to do farms. What do we have elevator-wise? We do have the open block style elevator. Now, I do want to do a create elevator because I've never done one of those. But having the open block style ones means that I can use those to start with, leave an area around it, and then do a create one. A create. I mean, they only need, like, what, a 3x3? Three three? Minimum? Yeah, minimum, I think, is about 3x3. Three three. Which, obviously, we're going to do a 5x5, five five, so we can actually have some containment around it, but, you know. I'll be alright. So I think that's everything for the list. So the tree farm harvesting contraption, we need the plant sower. We need the power to power the plant sower. We need the two sawmills for the logs to planks. Because obviously the first one will do strip logs, second one will do planks. Uh, we need storage for all the additional stuff. Um, 
don't know how I'm gonna go about doing that. Because we don't have, like... We don't have draws. So we don't have void upgrades. Never mind! Oh, wait. Uh, hmm. Uh, hmm. You still, you still testing? Yes. Can you grab a sophisticated storage container and the advanced void upgrade? Uh, did you add sophisticated storage in? I did, didn't I? Never yes. mind. Ignore me. Can't test that one for you. False. Okay. Um, okay. Uh, I do have so... a method of doing it with create. Okay. Is that going to be you... the um? Ah, don't tell me, don't tell me, don't tell me. The level emission thing you said. I can't remember the name of, god no. damn it. No? No. No? It is basically, you put a belt across the top, and a load of shoots into the things, and everything that doesn't work goes off into a lava pit. Ah. Immersive engineering tactic, right. Cannot deny that it's effective. That's true. It's, it's, it works. Um. There's also nullifier we can use because we have one of those. And that way, then I don't have to worry about uh, demagging everything. Oh, I say demagging it'd be sold and only being everything. Um. Yeah, and then transporting items around to get stuff back into the planter and out to, you know. I mean, I say out to here. It's going to have to come out from here to here and then get dealt with. And then saplings are just going to stay over there, I guess. But, I mean, we've got to sort out the item interface. And I have no idea how I'm going to do that. Uh, I could set that right here, I guess, because, I mean, it's going to be at this level. Like the contraption's gonna be here, so whatever. Uh, I it's... would always say, um, kind of plan your area for where you're going to deal with things, like your storage system, and then plan for where your interface can go attached to that. It's mm -hmm. much easier to work backwards in that regard. Okay. Well, we have the list for next turn. He has oh. a list. I've got a list. My God. Yeah, that's gonna have to do it for tonight, because like I said, I've gotta be up early in the morning and I've gotta go do some actual food that isn't just, you know, picking at a freaking kilo of chocolate covered peanuts. Um spot. Where is it? Hey, that's a lot of people. God damn. Uh who's doing what? Doing what? It's not okay. Uh, no, no, can't do that. No, no, no. That's me. No. Fortunately, theory isn't getting caught by ice traps again tonight. Ooh. I do I I do I. Ah, okay. Uh, Hartfang is playing Minecraft. So you know how I you know how I usually send people to games that I'm similar to what I'm playing. How about exactly what I'm playing? Um, enough, I suppose. Actually, wait. Is that gonna let me? It might if I actually spell the name correctly. Yes. Right. Okay. So uh, we're gonna go raid hard, Frank. But I'm gonna wait for the that to stop. I think it's flashing up on the screen again. Ah, anyway, uh, before everybody goes shooting off, don't forget, next Monday, six days from now, we're doing the um, five-year affiliate anniversary stream thing on a Monday. I'm going to be streaming on a Monday. That's going to be weird. Uh, but yeah, we're going to go say... I'm going to 
go through you all at the hot thing because I'm gonna like throw you all and then I'm gonna go get something to eat and I'm gonna go to bed. Uh, but thanks for coming, everybody. I will see you all on uh, Saturday when I'm probably doing more of this. And then uh, we're, we're gonna cause problems. Yeah, so Saturday will be Max creating more stress. Some of it even might be create. Yeah, some of it might actually be create stress and not stress stress, so. But yes, y'all have fun. I will see y'all Saturday. Goodbye! Bye, everybody.